Game Caviar. What's up, YouTube? It's not having it back with another episode of Game Caviar. I meant to put this up yesterday, but I did not have enough time. So now I'm bringing it to you with some uh, Warhammer 40k uh, gameplay. This is uh, um, a, a side note. This game is actually on sale for uh, PlayStation Plus Network um, uh, customers on the uh, PSN for five dollars. It's half off. It's a uh, this game is pretty fun. I played it earlier. And uh, I played the demo a while ago, and it was definitely a game that I uh, wanted to pick up. And I made a video of it, but I never made it public. But in that video, I did say when the game went on sale is when I was going to buy it, because I was being a cheap ass, and it was $10, and I didn't want to spend it, but $5 is right down my alley. So I bought it, and here it is. Anyway, got some news that I need to dive right into. First off, PS3, uh, Gran Turismo 5, Spec 2, coming soon. It's going to be like... It's going to be all the updates and everything that went along with the, uh, the the revamp of Gran Turismo. It's really not a revamp, but, you know, all the extra goodness that were that was added to Gran Turismo 5. They're going to put it all on the disc, and you can buy it in the stores. Of course, you can download it off the uh, PSN, and you, it's the, it's basically the same game. But, yeah, it's gonna it's coming soon. I, did, I couldn't find a date. I think I read that, um, that story on IGN. Or, no, no, it was uh, Game's Thirst. But uh, moving on. Uh, Battlefield 3, back to uh, Carklin. Downloadable content is coming to PSN December 6th. And it's coming uh, roughly a week later for Xbox 360. If you remember, uh, uh, Battlefield 3 is getting uh, the downloadable content for Battlefield 3. is coming out on PS, on PlayStation first. And then it's going to come out on Xbox. It's the exact opposite on uh, for Call of Duty. So uh, I guess this is Sony's way of getting back at Microsoft, kind of, you know, uh, moving along. There is a Smash Brothers spinoff coming to PS3. Uh, you know, uh, for those of you who are familiar with the Su Super Smash Brothers uh, video games, th there is a, um, a Sony-type game that, that uh, well, not a Sony-type game. It's going to be a game for PlayStation that's coming out. Um, and there's always, they, you can go on IGN.com and look this up. There has been, uh, the article that, uh, announced it. And then there is a, uh, an article about the dream characters that they would like to see in the video game. There hasn't been any sort of, uh, release date released yet, but keep an eye out on that. Uh, let's see. Um, since November 1st, DC online has been free and there is a, uh, downloadable content, uh, of flash that is coming out. And it might already be out, but if not, it's coming out soon. They have a video up on the internet. Uh, you can Google it. Many websites have it. But uh, DC Universe, when I first heard about it, I was like, this is an amazing idea. I definitely will check this game out. But then they charged a fee per month, and that turned me off of the game and a lot of other people. Now that the game is free, I do plan on downloading it and using it to the full advantage. But um, if you had paid for the game, you get a special uh, indicator or some sort of uh, you get some sort of perks because you paid for it. And then there's also like a five dollar fee a month and you actually get something for that. But um, I'm not going to go down that route. It's free. So I'm going to use it freely. And I'll put some videos of that up when I download. I have to download it off PSN. It's going to take forever. I know it will. But but yeah, um, keep an eye out for that. Uh, let's see. Uh, let me see. Uh, uh, there has been some sort of uh, discussion of the, uh, the the Vita's memory card prices. Um, and they, they, a lot of people think they're too much. I know GameSpot had, uh, not GameSpot, GameStop had posted prices for the, uh, the PlayStation Vita. Uh, the new handheld they posted the prices for the memory cards on their website and Sony had to come back and tell them to actually uh, correct them because they were listed wrong still they are um, they, they're kind of high I know that like the 32 gig memory card was like over a hundred dollars and that's that's really a lot of money considering how it's already like what 250 for the uh, the, the the system itself so I don't know I don't know 32 gigs is a lot of memory I don't know how many how, how much the I mean that's that's a lot that's a lot but anyway 
uh yeah check that out uh, ign.com had a story on it and i think game Stars did and may any any major website that deals with gaming is going to have that story so check it out um let me see uh xbox 360 uh south park rpg and 2012 is being made directly by the uh the, i guess the writers of south park are doing the uh the uh the writing for the actual game so that's going to be pretty good if um if everything comes out well then it's going to be an awesome game so keep an eye out for that in 2012 uh there's a ufc app that was supposed to release earlier on uh, xbox live and that's been pushed back to december 20th so all you ufc fans are going to have to wait a little bit more right before christmas before the app um drops on xbox live uh and uh during the Black Friday week, Xbox 360 sold 960,000 consoles. That's amazing. That's pretty good. Those are great numbers. I want to make sure I uh, put that in this video because, um, that I mean, they're moving. They're moving Xboxes. Uh, Microsoft has really did a good job of promoting their console and um, pushing it out to the people in America. Not so much overseas. Like, they, there's really no support for it in Japan, which is understandable. And in Europe, there's very little support for it. So, 960,000 copies in basically one country? That's awesome. Um, let me see. Uh, in other news, uh, Infinity Blade 2 gets a 10 from um, IGN.com, which is uh, a masterpiece. It's amazing. It's coming out on iPad uh, through the app store is it ipad it's, it's definitely i think it's made for ipad 2 but i don't know whether um you can get it on the on the first ipad i'm pretty i don't know i don't know i'm not gonna say i'm pretty sure because i just don't know but i know it's made for the second ipad and it it's, supposedly it has groundbreaking visuals and it, the game is just amazing i played the first infinity blade on um ipad and iphone and that game is is pretty awesome is is it has a very basic uh structure and idea behind it but the graphics and the gameplay itself is what really um boosts that game up uh that's all we have for the news um this video still has a couple minutes uh, left in it and um i just want to let everybody know that i finally have um gotten to the point where i have game caviar t-shirts okay these t-shirts are being sold and I'll put the link in the description um, if you're really down with this game caviar uh, movement then I will suggest you buy this t-shirt wear it proudly it, it's very simple it has a game caviar logo uh, on the front of it and in the back it has the uh, my YouTube channel on it and just wear it around if not still if you see this video and you like it check my channel out subscribe to my channel spread the word uh, drop me a comment drop me a like I really appreciate all of the support that I've been getting I have uh 70 or 71 subs right now and i'm still pushing to get 100 uh before the end of the year so before december 31st um I'm, I'm seriously trying to get 100 subs and i'm working every day and trying to get as many eyes on this site and on, you know the channel and the videos as possible i have a lot of support that i that i um very grateful for and i and i really appreciate everybody that that is really getting behind this movement i submitted my uh videos to a couple uh websites and i haven't heard anything back which is kind of disappointing but at the same time if they don't want to get um if they don't want to be a part of this game caviar movement that's their loss because it's not going to stop it's just getting better and better and better and it's gaining more momentum each and every day you know so um I mean that's basically it i i just just keep up the support guys and everything as always if you see my video and you like it as along with you know pressing like and commenting please just tell one person that's all i ask just inform one person so they can you know hopefully repeat the cycle um this video is over um i'm not having it and i'm out Game. 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 Game.